when will i get married marriage is a very important phase in everybody's life it is a legal social union of man and woman as per their custom and regulations marriage is not only the physical union but also an emotional union between the couples it is a lifelong commitment beginning of the family and helps grow selfless many are curious to know when they will be getting married what is the best year to get married is my marriage life going to be successful whether it is going to be love or arranged vedic astrology plays a very important role in determining about the timing of marriage and the success as well there are many combination of planners and rules set by our great sages to identify these facts through astrology even before checking when one will be getting married astrologers should analyze whether the natal chart is promising marriage if so then the planetary periods which is supporting marriage usually in vedic astrology the first important house for marriage is the seventh house it is called as the house of relationship the other important houses are second and ninth houses the second house indicates family and the ninth house indicates bhagya the role of planet is venus is important as he is known as kalatra karaka and without jupiter's blessings family will not expand Both the shabukti that is major and minor period and transit are important to solemnize the marriage whenever the major minor period of the second seventh and the ninth houses influence a person then it blesses with marriage along with the birth chart d9 chart that is the navamsa should also be seen for timing the marriage the ruler of the seventh house or the planet placed from moon venus and the ascendant can give marriage a well placed seventh house lord and venus can bless with early marriage the association of the fifth and seventh house could bring love marriage very heavily afflicted second seventh and ninth house and affliction to venus and the seventh house lord will deny marriage the affliction should be present in both birth chart and navamsa chart one of the divisional chart for predicting marriage if the second seventh and the ninth house is influenced by saturn then the marriage gets delayed the nodal planets rahu and ketu in the second seventh and ninth house can bring unsuccessful marriage leading to separation in transit jupiter should influence second seventh or ninth house for marriage to happen Venus and Mars transit are also important for marriage to be fixed. The transit of planets should influence both birth chart and the D9 chart also. Marriages are made in heaven and it is executed by the planets. Marriage makes or breaks is purely dependent on the karma of an individual.